Hi friends, I'm Colonel Failure and you're back again with The Rail Nation, uh, which Travian Games has very generously sponsored uh, for me to bring you up to speed on exactly what's going on in the game. Uh, there's only 69 players online at the moment. That's, that's quite quiet. And, uh, and it's the start of the day, so I've got lots to catch up on. Uh, and I thought this was the, uh, the perfect time for me to, uh, to kind of, you know, bring you up to date with what's going on. So uh, I, I'm going to start out by collecting all of these. Uh, in fact, if we zoom in a little bit, you might actually be able to see what I'm doing. Um, uh, collect all of these train spotting types who, who all give me cash, but I've got to rummage around a bit to fish them all up. So I'll get that done. You do the bombastic intro and then, uh, then we'll see what's what, shall we? Okay, so we're coming up on the end of Era 3, which is kind of early diesel era. Uh, we've got two days left in, in Era 3, and I've, I've done okay. Uh, I am in no way winning, um, that's for certain. I'm, I'm ranked 190th in the universe, and that's, I mean, that's adequate, but, uh, but it's hardly, hardly setting the world ablaze now, is it? Um, now, let's get the research out of the way. I've got uh, 32 out of my maximum 35 points. And uh, as you can see, I've uh, I've gone through the the top row here of all of the uh, all of the diesels in this era, and that's as far as I'm going. I've got one Osiris, I think, in uh, uh, in service, uh, but I use a, I use a couple of Morpheuses. I've got a couple of Ajaxes, and I've got a couple of uh, of Dionysoses uh, as well. But what I'm doing with my uh, my leftover uh, research points is I'm going back to era one. Because uh, there's a there's a cheeky achievement to be had by uh, by completing all research in one era, so I'm I'm doing that. All right, whale, never never going to buy one, but uh, there you go. I've learned that. As you can see, I've learned most of these now. Just got the mole to go. There you go. That's 19 out of 30. All right, I'll have that done today. That's uh, that's not going to be too big a problem. Uh, getting the rest of this lot done is going to be a little bit more pricey. Uh, so there you go, that's, that's my research up to date. I'm doing, you know, I'm doing solidly on, on the old research there. Uh, here's how we got through in, in Era 2. Uh, I went through uh, via the bat. Good, good starter loco is the bat. I had a, I had a giraffe for a while. Yeah, I did. And uh, and it ran the passengers around, made quite a bit of cash. Uh, the black bear's pretty good as well. Lynx didn't bother with. Cheetah's great for passengers. And then I stuck everything into the elephant, uh, which is a nice, big, fat, uh, haul a whole bunch of uh, freight kind of loco. And in fact, I've still got quite a few of those in service um, because I've researched it to the max, and therefore it's pretty good. Uh, right, okay, let's head over to, uh, to town and see what's going on there. I've got, to, I've got to do all my maintenance for the morning, but... But there it is. Right, I've got 280 large to pick up there. Thank you very much. Um, right, that's that's all good. As you can see, I've I've upgraded quite a bit. My lab's now up to uh, level 23, which is okay. Uh, it's it's not as good as some other people in the association. And for the life of me, I don't know. I I don't know exactly why uh, they're absolutely rinsing me. I think it's because they focus on. Um, uh, goods that are required by the town, but they're also doing better for money, which I don't understand either, because because uh, I'm chasing profits and town requirements kind of in equal measure. Um, but you know, I'll I'll go through that in a minute. Anyway, track production, I could probably sink another one into that. Although I've got a bunch of tracks that I can place already, I've not I've not used them all up. Construction yards helpful, but frankly, I tend to st stick stuff to uh, to update come back later when it takes five hours to build something and it's done so uh, so there's no real uh, no real loss there uh, I could probably yeah let's let's up my station concourse here now I could do it instantly if I decide to burn one of these free instant upgrade vouchers that I've got but I'm, I'm in no rush I'll be honest uh, I'm not likely to buy another train today so uh, you know just just get that one rolling uh, over on the hotel another six million. I've got 14. What else am I going to spend it on at the moment? Save up for another lab. Could do, but no, bung it in the hotel. The reason being, the hotel, uh, not only it gives me prestige, uh, which is what affects my ranking in the universe here, uh, but it also bumps up the amount I get from my, my free money depositors uh, once in a while. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, bung six million in that. Uh, right, back to the map. We're done here. Uh, okay, so... 
Uh, we're still basing ourselves out of Kirktown, as you can see. It's going quite uh, quite splendidly. Level twenty. That's that's not bad going. Uh, I think that is that's, that ranks us eighth. So we're we're currently doing enough to to make it through to end game. Uh, the top twenty town, uh, top ten, big bun, uh, will uh, will uh, be eligible to move through to uh, the end game, which is era six, if I recall correctly. So as long as we're uh, we're in the running for that, everything will be absolutely peachy, and uh, and we like it peachy. So uh, so that's all good. Ninety active players, yeah, okay. But I mean, you know, you've got Bolcott there that's only got forty six active players, and they seem to be doing absolutely fine. Cheeky blighters. In fact, Petertown, 46. Clockhaven, 40. What is this 46 business? Uh, it's, uh, it's clearly the number of success or some such. But going back to uh, to Kirktown here, I am fifth in, in town for delivering shoes. I understood that people wanted shoes. There we go. Uh, you can see that here's me from the, uh, uh, the Rail Brigade. Uh, you've got Fail Rail here, who are also representing quite strongly as well. We've we ended up having multiple uh, associations. Um, the the intention was to just have one, but uh, so many people signed up, we ended up with like four or five, um, which is terrific. Uh, we've all been playing nicely together so far, but I imagine that knives will be out uh, come the uh, come the end game. So. Uh, in order for me to better contribute towards town, I need to be looking for glassware, packaging, and steel. I'm not entirely sure I've got all of those. Uh, let's have a look. Here's his shoes. I'm not even connected to this one. As you can see, these little plus signs show me where I'm not uh, not actually connected. Here you go. That's steel. Looks like steel. Smells like steel. It's steel. Okay, right. Okay, let's go and, let's go and bang a couple of steel trains in there. I'll get everybody repaired. First, we do this at the start of the day. Select all, yes, a million quid down the pan, but I'm okay with it. Uh, I've just upgraded my career engine. So uh, so career engine, uh, you can carry from game to game. So obviously those who have played in uh, in previous games can, uh, can immediately uh, uh, have a bit of a bump start. See, that's my excuse. See, I'm playing up against people who've played tons beforehand and... And therefore, you know, they're, they're, they're just getting a bump start. Um, but uh, but no, I've been sticking all of my points in a wagon so far. And uh, and as you can see, I've got, uh, I've got four wagons attached right now. I could spend my 105 techno points on a bit more reliability. Not bothered. A bit more acceleration. Yeah, some top speed. Yeah, or I can keep saving forever and a day and get another wagon. Okay, all right, yeah, all right, okay, yeah, all right, yeah, all right. Bung it on the top speed there, Guff. Yeah, that's it, that's it. I'll tell you what, since I've got another 50 left, well, we might as well do that one as well. Let's do the cheap stuff. Right, good. Uh, so then we'll head back into the world and uh, and put those upgrades to good use. Right, okay, we're looking for steel. Steel is what we're looking for, and uh, I might as well just filter it here and see if it'll uh, it will allow me to, uh, to to grab what I want. Uh, steel, packaging, and glassware, if I recall correctly. Let's try steel. Show the results. There's no... It's a career engine. I'm an idiot. Career engine's a special one. It can only haul uh, a limited amount of stuff, uh, or a limited range of bits and pieces. It's largely... Uh... Oh, there we go. I seem to have found one. Yep, do it. I don't care that it makes less money than I'm making right now. Just get, Just get it done. All right. Okay. Good. That's that's going to transition over nicely. Uh, right. The Ajax is currently making absolutely nothing. It's a passenger train. No, it's not. It's not a passenger train. What do I think is a passenger train? Uh, it's currently hauling tools, and it's not making very much money. Now it is a passenger train. Why did it show me tools? I just would you please? Uh, there you go. Go do the Salt Springs. Now, with, when it comes to passenger stuff. Uh, I always try and uh, and have each of my passenger trains on a slightly different route, even though that means that I'm you know I'm losing seven grand there, because uh, it means that the likelihood of me burning through all of the uh, all of the potential profit from that route is you know I get longer at that price. So given that I'm only dabbling in a couple of times a day, it means that uh, I manage to maintain my uh, my profits for longer. It's probably a terrible strategy, but it's the one I'm using, and I'm quite happy with it. Um, 
Right, okay, the career engine's going to make it. No, it's, dead. no, it's not going to make a switcheroo at all. Decided it couldn't be bothered. Fine, in that t case, just take anything into Kirktown. Uh, oh, hold on, there you go. You could take some coal out to Kirktown Southeast, and that will help uh, make the steel produce a little bit quicker. So there you go, go and do that, and then talk to me later when you're actually, you know, fully operational. Meanwhile, uh, the Dionysos... Yeah, you're currently doing stuff with flour. No, 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 no. Just, just send up that one. Now go and talk to your Dionysos. All right. Hello, Dionysos. Now this will make me fifty-two large an hour if I if I send some coal out of Salt Springs. We don't like Salt Springs. They're the enemy. Uh, what I want is uh, is some newfangled gizmos uh, that will help the town uh, grow to be all it can be. And uh, and that's that's steel and it's packaging. I already do shoes and glassware. Mmm, tasteful. Still, show me your results. Fifteen thousand an hour. It's not a brilliant amount of money, but yes, we'll do it. Uh, now, as you can see, we've got a we've got a few that uh, that are unable to to comply because uh, they're uh, they're out of date. Apparently, the bull is already doing steel. I find that hard to believe. I would I would imagine if if it was, I would be making a bit more money. But it's okay. I'll put this Dionysos on there. Uh, we'll leave the elephants alone for the moment because they're they're bringing in good readies. Um, and we I mean we need good readies as much as we do. Uh, we you know need to be thinking about how do we grow this town. I realise other members of the town will be just going no oh, no 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 do the important work. And I go nah mate I, I'm all right. I'll uh, I'll keep doing what I'm doing. If it's all the same to you, there you go, and you as well. It's going to cost me half a million in wagons, but that's okay. I've got I've got wagons. Um, no, no, no. You you you'll be absolutely fine. We ought to have a look at this one though, and see if there's something more profitable you could be doing. Fifty-two grand to take coal out to Salt Springs. Get knotted. You can bring sausages to Kirktown, and you'll like it. There you go. Have uh, have a good time with that one. Yeah, see how you see how you get on. All right, okay. Yeah, you can also bring sausages to Kirktown and you as well. Right, because that's more money than the bread that you're currently doing. It means I'm buying a bunch of sausage wagons, but you never know when uh, when sausages are going to be in high demand. Right, that's that's that kind of semi-optimized. Uh, in the it isn't particularly optimized but uh, but there you go now i've got 20 messages waiting for me because there's always a, a thousand messages waiting for me in the system we've got it's usually notifications about the prestige that i've earned from deliveries uh plus people helping me out by collecting my rewards at my station for me which is which is jolly nice of them um yeah there you go lots of lots of nice uh rail brigade members helping me out there Meanwhile, we've got some chat going on here. Let's go. What are we doing? What's going on in the chat here? Awesome job. Good. That's all I need to read in that one. In this one, uh, yep, there's some. They're, you know, they're all talking about the game. They're, they're all strategizing and, and theorizing and so far, and, and and it's all it's all great. Largely, I tick through until I've cleared all my notifications, then I move on, which is possibly why I am not exactly leading the uh, the Rail Brigade Association here. We've got 20 out of 21 members at the moment, because uh, there's no one who is, is still active. Have a look at this. Look at all these inactive people. Uh, I've invited Kadozi here to, uh, to come and get in, but... I don't know if that I got her answer phone or something. Uh, Sam March has clearly played tons. Nope. Um, but I mean, this is the nature of these these kinds of games: is that uh, people sign up and then uh, and then you know disappear when uh, when they they lose a bit of interest. But we've still got plenty of people who are fully tuned in here, and then we're also carrying a couple of people who are perhaps not quite as tuned in as they might be. Uh, we're keeping Bingo Hasbat hazmat as our newbie despite the fact that he's, he's actually performing quite well um yeah so that's all good we can increase our membership count yeah all right stop telling me um uh increase our membership count again with how many more donations doing two more donations okay that's fine oh someone's declared us a rival cheeky ferraris too yeah i'm i'm excited 
Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, rivalry. Uh, okay, yeah, fine, whatever. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm terrified. Uh, meanwhile, licenses. What am I packing? I don't think I've got any at the moment. No. See, licenses are all important. These are coming up, right? So, uh, so get cattle. Uh, there's three cattle licenses available, and it means that every uh, every wagon load makes twenty eight quid extra. Yeah, 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 yeah that's fine. Uh, however, three three passenger license th plus three quid a passenger. I'll buy that. I'll even splash some gold on it as well. I've got I got four hundred and some odd gold. It's all good. So I'll get that one in. Is there anything else that I'm actually shipping? No. Uh, what's on the auction at the moment? Cattle. Oh, nobody gives them monkeys. Uh, no, I don't. I don't need a cattle flipping whatnot. No, just it's it's just not necessary. Um, right, you see, I've made another research point. Now I've got to unlock a few more bits of route here, uh, and I don't really know where I want to go next. I haven't I haven't decided. Normally, I've got some kind of scheme on the go as to what I want to unlock. In fact, if we zoom all the way out here. The uh, area under the fog of war are the bits that, that I've unlocked through my route building. Um, I think I should probably, probably head down towards Springville because I'm fairly close already. But if I can tap into a couple of goods types that I don't have, uh, I don't think I've got packaging, you see. Uh, although someone incredibly eagle-eyed might spot it on the screen now. So we'll take... It's going to be the best way to go. Probably Kirktown South down through Springville West. So let's get that one going. 747 grand. What a rip. Um, and that's going to take 13 minutes to do its thing. Yeah, all right. How many more routes have I got available? 23. That's a couple. Uh, yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, just can I, can I locate a particular goods type automatic alley? Uh, just by clicking a button that says, "Just show me where all of the all of the the, the uh, back packaging places are," and that'll be absolutely super, and we'll all be friends. Now these deserted bits here, something new will be built there in the future. So you know, I could get ahead of the curve. Competition has started. Oh, what's that one then? It's in Salt Springs. Oh, I'm not interested then. Uh, what is it shipping? Cattle. What to go alongside that license that I didn't bother buying? the very same okay all right okay yeah 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 uh no i think that's no i think i'm probably good for now especially since they're charging me the, the next lot um uh, route i buy is going to be about 100 grand i imagine um yeah so head down towards springville yeah there's i mean there's odds and ends of stuff down there but it opens up a new passenger route as well which is going to be fun um, but there you go. There you are. That's where we're up to. That's what's going on. Now, I've got one more of these to come, which will be the wrap-up after the game is over. Oh, yeah. And uh, and that's that's going to be that's going to be jolly exciting. As it looks right now, Kirktown should be in the running for the final 10. If it's not, then we'll have just missed out. But right now, it, it, it looks pretty solid. Uh, now that I've got my trains assigned... See, I'm, I've already started registering on steel for being a steel deliverer. Why I chose to look for steel rather than packaging, which is paying significantly more, is uh, is your guess is as good as mine, frankly. Uh, how are we doing on the old, old associations there? Glassware? And, oh, no, that's just my association. I don't, I'm not interested in that. How are we doing on passengers? I should probably, I should probably donate some towards passengers. I, I do bring a lot of passengers in. There we go. Yeah. Oh, that's 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 good. That's going to half my waiting time for two hours. Well, let's do that then. I mean, look, I've only made one donation. Oh, I'm such a cheapskate. Uh, yeah, I should be I should be donating much more than that. Uh, let's let's uh, let's spend a couple of my instant discount dispatch vouchers. That means my next trains are coming. Uh, are going to get flung straight back out again as though they'd uh, they'd waited the allotted amount of time. Anyway, there you go. There's there's plenty to dabble with, frankly, and uh, and I'm I'm a bit of a make weight as far as my uh, my association is concerned. Um, but that's okay. They they sort of gripe at me a bit and say that I'm not putting in enough effort. But uh, well, they they have the choice to either stick with it or uh, or or keep griping, I suppose. Um, 
Uh, but it's available now. You can come join in. We're on Com 3, which is a Smoke Chamber. Oh, yeah. You can still join. And if you join in a later era, you do get a bit of a bump up so you can contribute. Uh, Kirktown welcomes you if there's any space. There might not be. But if there is any space, we welcome you to come and assist in the glorious victory and so forth. And if you want to join uh, Rail Nation or, uh, or, or Fail Rail or um, what else have we got going on? Uh, Vapid Transit is in there as well. I, hold on, I've got, a, I've got a list somewhere. At least of the ones we're chums with. Uh, yeah, I know I don't have room for a worker. You don't have to keep telling me. Who's that? That's the Sunshine Fun Bus. They're recruiting. Uh, who's this lot? This is, yep, thank you. Uh, that, that's uh, Bam Bam Express. You'll know the names, friends. You're, I mean, uh, undoubtedly, and there's, there's Fail Rail. Uh, I'm sure it's all Vapid Transit around somewhere. But anyway, you know, get signed up. Come join in. Join us for the big push. Uh, there's only going to be, ooh, maybe a certain number, maybe three or four weeks left of this. Uh, and then we'll get to the grand finale. Thanks very much for watching. And thanks again to uh, to Travian Games for sponsoring this series. Uh, it has proved to be uh, mildly entertaining and diverting in amongst all of the other things that I do. And uh, and I, I look forward to getting the next batch of trains. What's in the next batch of trains? Why don't you just finish the video? I want to see what's in the next batch of trains. All right, okay, wait for it. Secrets. Well, okay, trains start looking weird in the next one. Oh, you've got to unlock everything before you can have Johnny Poseidon and his adventures. Roger that. Okay, will do. Ah, I look forward to it. Okay, thanks for watching. Cheerio. So there you go, part two of a three-part odyssey in the Rail Nation. Uh, I look forward to finding out how this is going to... Uh, develop you know because uh, there's nothing quite like playing with near total ignorance willful ignorance of that yeah i'm doing okay i'm hanging in there but when you've got people on your same team with double the number of points and you kind of go i'm here every day i'm tweaking and tinkering and pushing buttons and all of that kind of business what are you doing yeah it's just yeah but anyway uh, i'm tweaking and tinkering and pushing buttons and so forth and in about a month's time i'll be back with the grand wrap-up for how we have been totally, 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 totally victorious. Or not as the case may be. So tune in for that. Anyway, thanks for watching today. And uh, I'll be back with all of these, because I will. Yeah, there you are. That's it. No, you can go now. Thank you.